everyone welcome to my bedroom um i'm currently standing on one side of my room and i'm right beside my beautiful coat collection which is currently not in use but i've decided to share as many of my coats as possible with you i'm going to be trying them on individually and just talking through them where i got them uh, what brand they are why i got them and how much i miss wearing them i literally cannot wait to try these on lockdown has just made me one appreciate things i do have because i'm the type of person that constantly thinks i need more 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 and then also making me question if i've been a bit excessive in my past with coats because i do really like my coats and you're gonna see when i talk through some of them but also just in general like i said just to appreciate what you have and i just want to show you them as well and you could try them on with me um some of these coats i've worn video shoots I've bought abroad um, because they've been on sale. Um, some are branded and some are not. It just, um, I've never, me growing up really, the only brand I really loved was Nike. But um, becoming an artist, I'll be honest, like when it comes to like video shoots, I'm like, I've been, I used to think about, oh, do I need to wear name brands? I'm like, no, I only get it if I really like it, not because of the brand itself. And of course, if I can afford it. So like I said, there's a lot of the times the coats that I've got, I've actually managed to get on sale because I think that's a smart thing to do. Um, I'm going to start with one that I absolutely love and I really do miss wearing. Like I have nowhere to wear, like to wear this at all. This is my rainbow furry coat. It's so soft. If you know me, you know how much I love my textures. Um, and this one I got in L.A., um yeah it was like a small shop on the corner and I couldn't believe the coats that they have it's not real I don't wear real fur um I just absolutely love it it's really really nice and long and warm and you just feel great I remember when I wore this um I posted it um I posted a picture with me eating a rainbow uh bagel and this rainbow bagel shop uh, tagged me and they had so many different ones yeah I, I love my colors it just puts me in a good mood and especially times like this yeah it's nice just to touch it have a reason to wear it and just show you guys really so yeah this is one of my fur coats now another coat I really 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 love it's this d squared one and it comes with a rucksack ah uh, listen this coat again this was on sale um does say these squared really really big in there but when you wear it you won't know what it is so it doesn't have no big logos it's just nice and colorful as i like it so cute right i love this one and like i said it comes with this lovely bag now i got this one in new york i have a friend who actually works at the d squared store and basically it was the last coat and they already had a sale so i managed to get a bit more friends and family discount on it and it came with this bag as well i just had to get both um i remember some guy he he literally um while i had it on i was trying it on because i knew i was going to get it it's like so me as you can see um yeah I knew I was going to get it and this guy was like, can I try it on? And I said, and his mum and everyone was hovering around me. And I said, but you do know I'm getting this coat. And then they were, they were really upset. I was like, I just don't understand. So I let them try it. And they, they really loved it. Of course, it's a gorgeous coat. But yeah, there was going to be a bit of a, you know, shopper's fight going on there. So yeah, I do really miss wearing this coat. I just love it. I love my big coats, honestly. And I just don't have anywhere to wear any of these coats. Um... I'm just literally just wearing them for you. Uh, probably going to shoot a video and I might just, you know, wear, wear them in my music video or something like that because I've not really had the opportunity to even wear this because I literally got it the December before lockdown. So I've worn it probably about three times, which is a shame because it's so nice. But again, it just shows all the materialistic things sometimes. You don't, it's, it's not the be or end or, you know, you don't necessarily need it. But at the same time, it is nice to have a few pieces. By the way, I have built my collection up in like over the years, probably past four years. I've been building up my coat collection. I'll buy one really good one 
a year you know I, I invest in that that's just I don't buy it every month or something like that I have been building up my coat collection and it's just because I really love coats that's it literally <laughs> now another one of my favorite coats is this coat here um it's really long really big like I said I like big coats I love colors uh, this one's also d squared I got this a couple of years ago probably about probably about three years ago and again I've not really worn it uh smells amazing just to put it back on I've not worn this in ages oh I need to wear this in my next video I think look at this ah, you literally feel if you were to try this on it just feels like you're wearing a big duvet why not it's got a lot of anime on there it's just loads of colors it's just me really oh i miss wearing this so much it's really sad what's going on but at the end of the day being here like is a blessing you know you never know what can happen so all these materialistic things you don't even sorry to say this you don't really take it with you do you this is a really nice fur coat i actually got this from a market um and i couldn't believe it was there it was on sale i got it for a really good price it is joy rich it's co a collaboration with them coke and i just loved it you can see it's really soft it's just red and soft a bit like little red riding hood oh i miss all these so much i wore this at actually one of my first photo shoots with um a dope stylist her name's nisha and i wonder where the photos are but yeah i really miss this one it's a nice one it comes down to the waist oh just off it like below the waist and it's warm and it's just cozy i did go through a phase actually of just loving fur so uh, not real fur remember I'm, I'm not wearing real fur so this is another fur coat um i love this because I got this around the time I actually did um, a song called Pre My Ting and I just like the eyes because just went and um, it's a really cute brand it's called Mini Cream and the coat was just too warm but I didn't again I've not worn this a lot that's what I'm saying why have I bought all these coats and I'm not wearing them I really need to start making use of them oh wow look at this it's stunning isn't it I have been slacking. I think, actually, you know what? I think this is the one I'm going to wear in my next video. I really like it. Sometimes I question, like, why I've not used any of these in my music videos. I have used a few, but not all of them. I just don't make use of them. What's the point of having them? This next one I'm about to bring out is Insane. I think I've worn it once. And again, the reason why is because a few of these coats I got uh closer to lockdown so i've not really had the chance so and i don't wear the like i don't wear the same coats regularly i had like i got this one two years ago but it was a h&m and machino collaboration it was the last one i could it, literally they sold out in minutes everything and look at this sequence golden jacket another big one you already know the size is just me the color oh it's absolutely it's just insane it's beautiful. I still can't believe H&M and Machino did a collaboration. It's so sick. And again, it was, I think because it was the last one, it was actually discounted as well on top of it. So it was really good. It was um, affordable. Look at this. Oh, I don't even know where to wear this, to be honest. Everything is just sequenced to the hood. Oh my God. God I feel like I'm in some next robot video. I think it'll look dope in a... I don't really know. Where am I going to wear this? You guys should give me some suggestions, actually. There's nowhere to even wear it, but it's so nice. Oh, this is a really cool one. It's a reflective jacket from Pretty Little Thing. Oh, okay. I haven't really worn it yet. As you can see, it's still got the tag. But I plan on wearing this. I do. Oh, my word this is so dope i have actually been slacking how have i not worn this one again this is just so beautiful i really do miss like not miss life i feel 
bad things are happening right now, you know, it's not it's not easy. So while it's fun, I don't know, it's got this weird feeling about what's going on right now, but we are trying to stay positive. This is another one which I wore once to an award show and I haven't really worn again. It's um I really like I got it because I liked that one side had sequins and it was silver, the other side was black, the hood had some like leopard uh print fur and it's just like different colors you know like orange and blue i just like the clash and the difference in it which is why i got it um this one's also a machino and h&m collaboration and yeah just quite it's no it is really really nice i don't know why i've been unsure about what to wear it with i, I just don't I, i'll be honest i don't feel like it goes with a lot of things Maybe I'm not knowing how to rock it. I've not really worn it, but I got it because I like the colours. Like, it looks cool from the top half. I feel like, yeah, it's really nice. But, like, what shoes do you wear with that? Black and leggings? You have it closed? I guess you have it closed. But, yeah, I like this one. I think it's cute. <laughs> Gosh, I think I went through a phase of sequins. So, this is another sequins jacket. The white one, as you can see, I don't really have white. I have a lot of colourful and rainbow colours and yeah, just just a lot of colours. So I, I needed to get a white jacket, which is why I actually got this one. And this one was from TK Maxx. We got TK Maxx. They do have some good pieces there that you'll find that, you know, you may not find in other stores really. Just those one-offs. So yeah, I really like this one. Look, it's shiny. And, oh string on it so yeah it's just nice again i never used to be a fan of sequins because i just didn't like the feeling before but these are so soft it's unreal <laughs> it's so nice but it, you know they're so delicate you have to be careful which is probably why i've not really worn it a lot i'm going to show you one i got from amazon i think this coat is dope it was like 12 pounds and can you guess why I like it? <laughs> I'm not even going to tell you the answer. <laughs> um, and yeah, I got this because for one Halloween I was pretending to be 6'9". But um, yeah, those days have gone. So now I just wear it. I really like the colours. All right, the answer is I love rainbow colours. So this is just gorgeous. Oh, it's so nice. And again, not made use of it. I've not worn this enough. And I'm very mad i'm very mad i can't even do anything i can't do anything with my coats now i got this one from forever 21 in new york i think and i got it because i do love versace and sometimes you can't afford versace you know so this is quite close to it it looks similar i love it this goes with like a lot of things even though it's got a lot of like drawings and patterns actually goes nicely with outfits i really like this one you can wear it with a tight fitted outfit you can wear it with a tracksuit if you're like me i do switch it up from tracksuits to yeah all sorts another coat i love and i've worn this a few times i wore this coat um in my music video called instant a few years ago probably about four years three four years ago gosh like i said i've been building up my coat collection for time this one is just so dope look at this mad in it it's just shiny it's blue let me know what your favorite one is so far and this is a nice one this is a nice green one short waisted one this is from asos big up asos you do find some really great pieces from asos it's unique I like the Velcro here. It's like, doesn't have, oh, it does have zips as well. But I don't know, it's just like the Velcro looks nice even when it's open. It looks like a, you know, like just like some sort of, like it was deliberate. Just gives it extra attitude and sass. I like it. Again, if you're just trying to look a bit more feminine, you know? When I'm feeling a bit juicy like an orange, <laughs> I go for my orange coat. I've wore this quite a few times. I fell in love with it when I got it. It's just, just looks so sweet, doesn't it? Just looks like sweets actually. Like you just go, 
that's one of my other coats that I really, really like. Orange coat, can't go wrong. Nice, thick um, collars and thick coat, but not too big again. And yeah, I usually like to match my trainers, match my hats. Yeah, I'm a bit of a freak like that. So that's why I got this because and then I got orange beanie cap and that's like all the colours to go really. This is my final coat that I've chosen to show you and this is just a cute one from Miss 60. It's red, shiny, long, with a hood. I like this one and I want to wear it in a video because it's so cool. Look at it. Oh, I forgot to tell you, it actually opens up a bit. So if you wanted to wear it in a funky, fashionable way, you know, down the catwalk, you really can. Yeah, this is it, literally. And you can um, open the zips here as well, somewhere. Oh, it is open. If you have a look, it's currently open. You can actually close the zip and make the coat tighter. But I personally like my coats nice and wide and just... Yeah, I like baggy coats basically. I like puffers. So yeah, anyway, I'm so glad I got to show you my coat collection because it's a bit like therapy. Um, I've not really had a chance to wear any of these. It's a bit depressing that they're just sat there doing, like I said, just getting dusty. I'm sure I've found a cobweb and a spider on there. But um, yeah, it, it's made me think that I do have enough coats. I need to stop going excessive with the coats. Um, and there's no point anyway where, where am i going to wear it and also it made me appreciate what i have so i hope you enjoyed my little tour of my coats i'll do some more if you want of like other things and i hope you enjoyed it tell me what coat you liked best and make sure you subscribe i'm gonna go and actually do some more work now not lay down on my bed as much as it is tempting thank you for joining me